All right, y'all, welcome back to another episode of uh, Pipes and Picking, a pipe story. Uh, shoulder's feeling a lot better this morning, and so I decided to get the guitar out and uh, play along with y'all. This is my Gibson uh, Hummingbird Pro. I got a couple years ago. I call it Workhorse because it just takes a beating on stage. I tend to be a heavy guitar player, a heavy strummer, and... Uh, Man, it just beats. It just takes a great licking on stage. Takes a, a lot of abuse. Well, not abuse, but uh, but it's also a good workhorse. I write a lot of my songs on it, and uh, it's just a great instrument. So that little intro, I, I did a little uh, uh, our band's version of uh, Buddy Waters' classic "40 Days, 40 Nights." That's the way I play that song on that. Here's a little Robert Johnson. When I come home in my kitchen, the pouring rain raining, I know. Oh, the woman I love, oh, my best friend, that joker got lucky. Again. You better come on in my kitchen. It's gonna be raining, I know. Anyway, just doing a little jamming there, doing a little picking. Uh, and it's not all, I don't play all gut bucket country, but I got gut bucket blues, but I sorted it. Uh, anyway, I just wanted to come out, do a little picking with y'all. Uh, this is a, this here is a little uh, LaRocca pipe, another one here. Doesn't have a name on it, um, just says LaRocca Italy. You can see maybe right there. But a uh, little slight bent black sandblast. Uh, it's not the original uh, stem on it, but... Uh, Man, great pipe. Uh, really pretty sandblast. As you can see with that black stain, did a really good job on it. And then they left a little bit of cordovan or a blue or red right there going into that black stem. Great, great pipe. Uh, I love it. It's it kind of came to me already broke in with English and it, uh, it's a really good English pipe. And speaking of, I've got a little Dunhill London mixture in here. Unfortunately, it's sort of the bottom of the of the jar, and it's really hard to get for obvious reasons. And I really like it. It's uh, good little pipe. Good little pipe. So. Anyway, not much to talk about today. Just wanted to come out here and do a little picking. Uh, do a little picking with y'all and uh, smoke my pipe and talk to y'all and uh, go from there. Uh, really do like this pipe. It's good, nice balance, good heavy bowl, fits you know, really well in the hand. Hangs out of the mouth right. Good little pipe. Also, I want to thank uh, this James Long for uh, the shout out yesterday. I really appreciate it, man. That was really cool. I, uh, I really enjoy your stuff too, man. I really like uh, your take. And I'm, I am gonna break out and try those aromatics. The more I thought about it, the more I think it's the chemical that oh, that overdone propylene glycol that probably irritate my throat so i'm uh i think i'll do that and do a little review of it myself so anyway not much of a video today i just wanted to do a little blues picking talk about 
Black Beauty here that I call. Uh, really great pipe, really great pipe. Another here, another bent, another evidence of uh, LaRocco just sticking it on the on the bents and the slight bents. And um, I do, I know I said straight billiards, my favorite type, and I've got a really cool straight billiard LaRocco that I'll probably either do next time or the time after that, I haven't decided. I've got an author that's really cool too. Uh, so anyway, I've really enjoyed doing this LaRocca series. I'm hoping it's giving uh, some attention and hope y'all are learning about a new pipe that you may have heard about, um, but hadn't had the opportunity to try out. I hope it's kind of tipping the, tipping you on forward on the, uh, on picking up a LaRocca because it's, it's a darn good pipe. So, got a little gurgle in here. But anyway, y'all have a good one. Y'all keep on picking. Y'all keep on puffing. And I hope y'all have a good day. See you later.